I've been carrying Olight flashlights for years and I love them. Use the link below and code Olight10 for 10% off anytime. SHOT Show 2019, we're back at Steel Wheel Knives with Paulina. Hello, Hi, how, how are you? Great. Having a good show? Yeah, so far so good. Good, good. I want to see some of the new knives you guys are offering. Uh, we have something new for you that we'd like to share with you for sure. And probably I will start with something that our fans and customers are already familiar with that, but not everyone got that in hands. So those are piercers, which we released early this January. And I believe there have been already a lot of positive reviews on social media. Yeah. And I think it is becoming as popular as some of our previous models were. Uh, as you know, or you might probably know, Piercer is presented in three different versions. Frame lock, as in this model, and also two other liner lock models. One is setting coating, setting, setting and, yeah. yeah, setting blade and black, and black coated. coated. Yeah, wash. They're very good looking. Yeah, I like that. And they got a really aggressive mm -hmm. blade shape as well that just fills up the whole whole thing. I love it. It's great design. And that is, you can see there that that is um, through that, that is your uh, opening uh, method right there on either the frame or the liner lock. It's no flipper or anything like that. So I'm going to give you guys kind of a, the pocket clip is one of the things that really stands out to me is very, very cool. Yeah, that's, I believe that's the first or among the first models which we have with deep carry clip. Yeah. We had a lot of inquiries about that and finally we have something to offer for the lovers of the deep carry. It's very thin, very uh, very sexy if I may say so, and you can yeah, flip yeah. it around to the other side by unscrewing it there and popping it over here. Right. Cool. And that's also the, the first knife which we have with this opening thing yeah. with the hole using for the opening. Thumb hole instead yeah. of, yeah. yeah. So, and also let's probably proceed to the intrigues which some of the customers have already seen. Here we have new intrigues models which also have been released early in January. And those are for those who doesn't really like the shiny blade. Now you've got it in a black coated as well. Yes. So it's, it became, if previous intrigues were really elegant and slim, yeah. This one becomes more aggressive, probably. Sure. I would say. In yeah. both sizes, black coat. Both now. sizes as well. Very cool. For different customers. Then, uh, what is coming next would be okay, let's proceed to the February things, which we will release in several weeks. And if you follow us, you will definitely know about that. So, mm -hmm. those are lanterns. Here we have those three leather models. It is presented in uh, two different sizes, as most of our knives do. Uh, and as well, different coatings and G10 handles here. And cool backspacer on it. Yeah, the aluminum. Yeah, all red. Shiny. Yeah. But we also have the black one as well. Black one. The, the whole black model. Yeah. Black blade with the black spacer and black G10 on it. Very cool yeah. looking. Um, the lanner, L-A-N-N-E-R. I believe that's a type of bird? Yeah, that's the falcon. Okay. Mediterranean falcon. So the the blade shape is somehow resembles the bird Okay, like face, the beak, yeah. yeah, profile, is so it? forth. Mm -hmm. And the the big, the larger one is 3.75 inches long. Yep. And the smaller is 3.25. Yeah, that three so and a quarter one is the one that I would be loving. That's really cool. Uh, as far as the design, to me, this feels like it lands almost perfectly in between in between the intrigue and the cut jack. Yes, that that's what I was about to say actually. So the size, the design yeah. is something in between those knives. So for those who believe that intrigue is too slim, for example, yeah. or cut jack is too large, yeah. that would be the perfect choice. Yeah, aesthetically, it's almost it's pretty much everything that you get from those other two knives, just a little bit, you know, in between them. Yeah. So very cool. I like the exactly. lanyard. 
Then I would also uh, pay your attention to such knives which also the customers are already familiar with and that is the very popular cut jack yeah. but uh, next month we will have them in new colors like for example the blue large cut jack because we did have the mini version in blue yeah and had a lot of uh, questions in regards to the larger one and, yeah. and finally those customers could get the cut jacks in blue okay yeah cut jack large and blue and cool. also for those who love m390 we will have this wild green M390 cut jack that. available. It, here we have only larger size, but yes. it will also be available in mini version in so this wild green. This is what the large looks like. This is what the mini looks like. Uh, yeah, large, like that. Mini. Large, mini. <laughs> three basically. and a half, three inch as usual. Yeah. Uh, cool. That what is awaiting our customers in the closest future, but in in March, like in two months, we will also release the Plug Doctor knife. Here the plague, it is. The Plague Doctor. Look at that thing. We will also have that in different colors and sizes. Mm -hmm like that the clip is also convertible yeah as most of our knives do g down handle g to steel and i love this blade shape if you do remember the history and those real plug doctors when i first seen that i had this picture in my head from history i, I believe that's awesome yeah. so there is the thumb thought just you could feel that it yeah it, it's perfectly in hand. And it's very cool. It's very aggressive. It's very much yes. forward leaning. So you get your thumb up there and it really wants to kind of lean forward and do stuff. Uh, mm -hmm. This one is the larger one of the two, but I would just call this like an extra large <laughs> and a large. A large there's, there's really no small or medium here. It's just large and extra. We large. mostly have like some elegant and elegant, small yeah. knives, but here we finally have something aggressive. Aggressive, large. And there's lots of guys who want that. Yeah, a little totally. bit. Totally. Yeah, there actually will be some other piercer knives as well. So we okay. will release. Four of them. Yeah. Four of them? Yeah. Okay. Uh, different colors. But mostly it will be black, satin, coating, this OG green, and the different combinations. So we're going to see a bunch of variations of the, uh, of the piercer as time goes on. Yeah. Cool. That was kind of the star of the show for most of you guys. But to me, I'm really digging the lantern. I think that is a sweet knife. That is just my size, just my shape, and I'm a fan. Mm-hmm. Cool. Anything oh. else you want to cover, Polina? Um, I, I realized that there would be a lot of questions in your comments in regards yeah. to Antlock model, uh, which a lot of people await as well. So we have the prototypes here. Mm -hmm. uh, this lock mechanism, which we have presented several years ago, I okay. believe. And that is our own patented lock mechanism. Okay. Which I have troubles working with that yet because okay. I'm not yet that used to it. Oh, I managed to this yeah, you time. You did it. You did it. Yes. Yeah, so uh, we will have that soon. Okay. There is no official release date, but that's our child, which have to be liberated. Yeah. And we are we are doing our best to give our customers that as soon as possible. Hopefully, right. <laughs> we are all waiting for that. All right. That's worth playing with as well. Yeah. All right, Polina. And this, this will be called Tasso. Tasso. Just for everyone That'll be called the Tasso? Yeah. Gotcha. Got it. Okay. That's it. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. We are at Steel Wheel SHOT Show 2019. Thanks for watching, guys.